case test. So uh, the story behind this is, um, I guess my mom just randomly decided to get a new drink. Or try a new drink. She ended up not liking it and being like, oh, you're on it. Um, I don't know why, because this woman religiously drinks red rose tea every morning. A cup of that. With a little creamer and, you know, her little packets of sugar. And then the rest of the day she'll drink Diet uh, Pepsi. And, like, that's 99.95% of the time. And then on your rare occasions you might have a small glass of orange juice or a sip of water or a little chocolate milk or something. Some other thing. So I was like, when this came in the order today, I was just like, does this accidentally get mixed up with my other sister's order or something? Because, like, why the... F She's the one I know that drinks Mountain Dew. Like, I, I like Mountain Dew, but I, like, I don't drink it. I don't order it. But, um, like, I drink it and I do like it. I just, the only times I've ever drank it is when I, like, years ago, like, I think I was still in fucking middle school, uh, we would go to this place called, like, Round Table Pizza, and they had, like, you know, the drink machines or whatever. You go up and you hit the thing and it goes in a cup. Um, and I would get, like, Mountain Dew or root beer, because that was kind of the only thing I really was interested in. That happened to be on the selection there. They had other stuff like probably Coke or Pepsi or something. I don't know. But yeah, so I sat. So what I saw is I was very confused. But I have tried other flavors of Mountain Dew. Like the regular just green one. I like that. And then I've tried Baja Blast somewhat recently. I don't think I did a review. But I like that one. And then there was another one. I can't remember what the flavor was. But I remember what the packaging was. And I think it was like yellow and it kind of had like a graffiti-esque um, art style to it. I'll have to actually go and look it up. But anyway, this way, uh, this one is uh, Mountain Dew Major Melon with a weird creepy derpy melon. Can you, can you see? Yeah. It smells like Mountain Dew. I don't know how to describe Mountain Dew to you. What it tastes like, what it smells like. If you've had Mountain Dew, you know what the fuck Mountain Dew tastes and smells like. It smells like that, but like... It kind of smells like watermelon, but it kind of smells more like strawberry. So how many? I don't know. I have a screw loose, so... I don't really know if it tastes watermelon-y. More than anything, it just tastes like Mountain Dew. It just tastes like Mountain Dew to me. I don't know why that's funny because, like, I don't know how to describe it. Like, Mountain Dew is just Mountain Dew. You had it, you know. That's what it tastes like with a slight watermelon hint to it. I like it. I would drink it. Um, I have no problem with it. I just... It's a short review. I don't know how to explain it. It really is just, like, it tastes like fucking Mountain Dew. I don't know what it is specifically... Specifically, specifically they put in Mountain Dew that makes it taste the way it is, but like if you've had Coke or you had Pepsi, you can tell what's a Coke and what's a Pepsi. I like either of those, but I grew up with mom drinking Diet Pepsi, so I'm more prone to like Diet Pepsi. But then again, lately, in the last few years, my sister has been getting a lot of Coke drinks, so I've been stealing some of her Coke or in Diet Coke stuff. So now I can have either or. And I think she just, my sister described it as... Pepsi is sweeter and Coke is more savory. Like, I'd have to taste them with each other to, like, give you my opinion if I think that or not. But they definitely do have a specific taste. Like, if you give me, like, blind taste, test me a Pepsi and a Coke and, like, a Dr. Pepper, I could probably be like, okay, that's a Coke, that's a Pepsi, that's a Dr. Pepper. Um, they all kind of have, like, their distinctive uh, taste. And that's kind of what this Mountain Dew is to me. It, it just, like... Yes, it does taste like watermelon, but it really just does taste like Mountain Dew, just with a hint of watermelon. It's not bad. Like I said, it's good. I do like it. I would get it. Like, I would happily drink it again. It's not like, I'm like, ew, okay, try that. Eh. No, like, I like it. It's just, I'm not going to go hunting down. It's not like my new favorite thing. I'm just kind of like, okay, that's kind of good. And if we have it, maybe I'll drink it, you know? But anyway, like, I'll just go to my videos and I guess try this. I don't know where she got this. I'm assuming Walmart. We usually get stuff from Walmart. So, like, either Walmart or Costco probably Walmart though uh, you can probably fucking google it and find somewhere they always sell stuff like this at other places anyway I don't know what other flavors they have of Mountain Dew I mean I know they have like a, a blue one I know they have Baja Blast which I'm confused because the only other Baja Blast thing I've had was like a Baja Blast from Taco Bell like I tried it one time and I did not like it 
And I don't know if it was just that mine didn't have a lot of syrup in it or something, but it literally just tastes kind of like seltzer to me. And uh, I do not like seltzer water. I like soda because I can taste the, the whatever's supposed to be for a seltzer. All I taste is the carbonated water, and that's unappealing to me. Because it's carbonated water, not really tasty. Um, so I need something to cover that. So when I drink soda, I like the flavor of whatever that thing is with a little hint of the bubbly. I don't just, I don't want seltzer water. Like, where did I read or hear somewhere that seltzer water is just water that hurts you? <laughs> uh, yeah, like, I'll subscribe to videos and bye.